Hey guys, welcome back to other Minecraft Spigot plugin tutorial here. Today I'll be showing an amazing plugin here called Ultimate Auto Restart. Okay, so it's basically a plugin where you can schedule restarts every day or even by commands. Like if you want to restart the server in 60 seconds, you can do it with a single command. So I'm going to be showing it to you once I'm in game. So it's everything's pretty much here as you can see the feature list and there's even the Discord server like for support. And it's a default config, default messages. I'll show you everything once I'm showing you the config part. And yeah, like if you're running a network, you could use this add-ons. I won't be showing it to you as there's nothing really to do with it. You can just upload it to your Bungie server if you have one. Okay, so everything is actually written here. There's nothing really to say, but I'm gonna show you again. It's basically like the 24-hour clock. So like if you want, to, if you want a, a restart at 11 p.m. Okay, so it's basically Monday 11 p.m. And this one's friday 2 a.m same with here daily 12 p.m which is basically like every day 12 p.m and the best parts the plugin supports from version 1.8 to 1.18 and the command right so this this is pretty much the command like if you just type ar you're going to see this as a player and you're going to see this as an admin so these are the commands i'll be showing it to you so and now i'll be showing you in game So all I'm gonna do is just slash air. So here's the admin panel, the admin output that I showed you in the resource page. So it's, the list of commands are here. So as you can see, this AR now. I'm gonna show that in the last. So this AR version. It's gonna show you the plugin version, and it's gonna tell you if there's an update. And there's AR reload. So this AR stop. That's only when there's a restart happening. So like already cancelled it right now. See. So now there's another command here. This AR time it basically tells you how much like how was the next restart like when is it so I'm gonna show you now so there's AR now I'll put it 6000 seconds that's basically one hour so now if I do AR time it's gonna tell me the like the duration as you can see so now I'm gonna do of myself and now if you do AR you're gonna see this you're not, you're not gonna see the admin panel but you're gonna see this okay so there's nothing really else actually pretty much that now I'll be showing you the config so let's get on with it okay so I'm back here at the config YML so the first thing I'm going to show you is config.yml so you'll already see most of the stuff here with hashtags because the author already did a great job here writing everything so again I'm going to show you the stuff because you might not understand some so yeah here's the starting settings so here's every notes you might want to read basically like monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday and there's actually even daily here like i already showed you at the start right at the resource page right so here's the commands like i think this one before the restarts like on schedule what's it's gonna do so before the restart happens they made sure that the world is saved and everything and then there's a the restart and here's the commands after reboot like you know this actually hashtagged out but if you remove this it's gonna send like after you start like after 15 seconds it's gonna broadcast this every Wednesday like it's pretty much that and this is the proxy part like if you download the Bungie setup like the Bungie plugin then this will work and it's pretty much that it's gonna say this after 30 seconds of the like reboot and here's the restarts as you can see it's like 12 am and pm that's what they scheduled but if i wanted wanted it to be only 12 am all i gotta do is just cut this and remove this hashtag and that's it's pretty much that and here's a like message at intervals basically like 60 seconds 30 seconds 3 seconds 2 seconds 1 basically that and i think you can configure the sounds i'll show you that afterwards and here's the intervals like sounds at intervals so like if you want to synchronize both it, both of it so like if you want to sound it every like interval but you can do that and there's you know, pretty much that you don't need to ignore that so here's the delay restart part so like if there was players and you didn't want to lose players because most of the time server owners lose players on restarts so like if you want to do it like through and then check seconds before restarting and minimum players like if you had like 5 players or something you could just skip it and it's pretty much that 
and here's the pawn match you don't need to really change it because everything is set up here and pretty much that okay so i'm going to be showing you messages start by there's nothing really here you can actually just edit it here if you want to and this is pretty much everything else action bar titles chat message pretty much everything here you don't need to change anything but if you want to change the theme that's an extra level of work but again it's not really suggested to and here's the sounds.yml this is very configurable if you must ask because like you can actually just go to the wiki here where is it right the sounds i don't think they've given it here but if you search nm sounds or whatever it's called you'll find it so yeah it's pretty much that i'll show you everything if you have any concerns comment down in the comment section and like the video if you liked it and subscribe for more plugin tutorials see ya